As many of you Rocket League players know, Bacchus mod exists, and 80% of PC players use it. But did you also know you can add a lot more useful features to Bacchus mod? Well, those useful features come in the form of plugins. At the time I'm recording this video, there are 157 plugins on the Bacchus mod website. So, I decided I should make a list of my 10 favorite plugins. All of these plugins are linked in the description. So, let's begin. At number 10, we have the Speed Flip Trainer. This plugin is very useful for learning the speed flip. It only works on Musty Speed Flip Training Pack, and it shows you everything about your flip. The angle of your flip, how soon you cancel, when you flip, and how straight you're moving while flipping. This plugin is very useful and I fully recommend it if you're struggling to speed flip. Then at number 9 we have the Dribble Trainer. Just like the Speed Flip Trainer, this plugin is used for learning a mechanic, in this case dribbling. This plugin basically tells you where to keep the ball in your car, and when the ball drops from your car it automatically pops it onto your hood. There is also a Flick Trainer in this plugin, but I never learned how to use it. At number 8 we have a plugin called In-Game Rank. This plugin essentially shows everyone's rank in their best playlist on the scoreboard. You can change it so it shows their rank in a specific playlist like 2v2 or 3v3, but by default it's set to their best rank. This plugin isn't really that useful, but it's fun being able to see what everyone's favorite playlist is. At number 7 we have the Predictator. You may or may not have seen this plugin in other Rocket League videos, but all it does is it shows where the ball is bouncing or going in general by using a green line. If you are really struggling to read ball bounces, this plugin can help you. It only works in free play though. At number 6 we have a plugin called On Target. This plugin displays an image of the goal and where you shot the ball around the goal. If it's off target, it will show an X on the image so you know how far off you were. If you use this plugin daily and practice shooting, you will notice the X is disappearing and moving closer to the goal. At number 5 we have a plugin called Controller Overlay. This plugin shows a controller overlay on screen so you can show your controller inputs without an overlay on your recording software. And also when you stream on Discord, the overlay is visible so you can show your friends your controller inputs. And that's all there is to this plugin. It's very basic but very useful. At number 4 we have the hitbox plugin. This plugin displays your car's hitbox, it can be used in free play and in replays. With this plugin, you can see how much the hitboxes really differ from each other, and how correct they are compared to the actual car model. At number 3 we have the Rocket plugin. This plugin is used for playing workshop maps with friends. If you have seen YouTube videos where people play workshop maps together, it was possible because of this plugin. This plugin would be my number one if it wasn't so non-functional all the time. Maybe it's our fault, but anytime me and my friends play we have to troubleshoot for at least 30 minutes before we can play. Other than that, this plugin is remarkable. At number 2 we have the free play checkpoint plugin. This plugin is fucking amazing. It lets you make a checkpoint in free play by pressing a button. And when you want to, you can load that checkpoint and everything will be the same as when you hit that save checkpoint button. In other words, you can go back in time. This plugin saves a shit ton of time when practicing a specific shot. If you don't have it, install it immediately. And finally, at the number one spot, we have the Alpha Console plugin. Long story short, back in the day, the only thing that existed was Alpha Console. But when Bacchus mod came out and became a much better third party mod, Alpha Console died. And the creators transferred it as a plugin for Bacchus mod. The Alpha Console is strictly a cosmetics mod, with it you can add a custom decal, underglow, change your banner texture, have reactive wheels, completely change your car body, but only in free play paint your alpha boost, 
and much more. Basically, Bacchus mod and Alpha console go hand in hand. If you don't have Alpha console, I urge you to install it. There are more than a hundred more plugins that I didn't even mention in this video. I would suggest that you see all of the plugins on the website and install every single one that you like. And that concludes my top 10 plugins list. I hope that you enjoyed this video and you learned a thing or two about plugins in Bacchus Mod. If you have any questions about Rocket League, DM me on Discord. And also follow me on Instagram and TikTok. Thanks for watching.